outside of our house. This is the next episode of Minecraft. Now, I have been slowly getting other items over here in our farm area. As you can see, we have potatoes, carrots, wheat, pumpkin. I placed this block here so the pumpkin would grow the correct way, just so it looked better. I know, I'm weird. Alright, so today I would like to go look for a village or just kind of sightsee and see what's going around the world in our seed that we have here. So, last time we went down over there and got a bunch of coal. And I think what I'll do is I'm going to take a bed with me so I don't have to deal with a bunch of mobs spawning while I'm looking around and just sightseeing and see if we can find anything great around our area. So, let me grab one of my beds just in case. Here we do have some extra bamboo. All right, here we go. And I don't know if you guys know, but bamboo like this makes sticks, so that'll work pretty good for us. All righty. One thing I would love to get in this series is some villagers and create a villager hall. A uh, nice little, you know, different trading area stuff like that. I was over here one time before, you can see my arrow and it tells me I live that way. Uh, don't know why I built it, you can see it clearly. Anyways, let's go see what we can see this way, guys. I don't know why I brought my diamond hoe with me, but uh, hey, you never know when you'll need it. I'd also like to get a couple other style trees. We have oak, and we have this style tree here, which I believe, what is it, a, 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 acacia, I guess you call it? I'm bad with words, so yeah, go ahead and fix it in the comments below, guys, how you pronounce it. Alrighty, let's see what this has in store for us over here. Looks like a hole. This looks like two different biomes kind of blending together, huh? So maybe we can find us a nice little villagers or something this way. Let's see what we can find. I'm going to try to start posting a little bit more often, guys. Uh, it's just been a hectic schedule. A lot of different things going on at home. I'm only able to record when I have the time. So until I'm able to record more often, I will try to put out a couple videos per month. Uh, I'm going to try to start putting them out more per week. Uh, looks like we got a fire going on over here. Let's go check this out. There must be some lava over here. That's what it seems like. Well, looks like it's already burned down most of it. Oh, this is one that we've already been to. Mm, great. Let's chop this down. Let's not leave this looking like this. This does not look the greatest. You know, I went out here searching for stuff and I guess I already came to this area. When I got, I believe it was when I got the bamboo, I was over this way. And now I'd like to kind of go a little bit further than these woods. We do have these trees. We can do this and get some of their saplings. I don't know if you guys know this, but this diamond hose or any type of hoe, really, if you, uh, set it correctly and you get a fortune on it it will actually give you more seeds and more apples but I have efficiency 4 and I'm breaking 3 on there for now and I actually get quite a bit of stuff so let's sleep through the night real quick and get rid of all the 
bad stuff that will spawn just because I don't feel like dealing with it. Not that I can't handle it, but uh, you know how that works out. Just much easier. We do have good armor and a nice sword. It's may not have the best enchantments yet, but uh, we will work our way there. For now, this will actually hold us off pretty good against a lot of the zombies and stuff like that, but I definitely want a better armor and better sword when we go attack the ender dragon. And the wither will be a big challenge. No matter what, I will always die the first time I fight one. I don't know what it is about the wither, but uh, especially on bedrock. Bedrock, the wither on bedrock is uh, extremely hard for me. Now, most people can probably kill it, no problem. There are tricks to killing them, and I will probably try that in this series just so I don't have to die as easy. So, it looks like we got us a nice abandoned portal here. Let's go see what this has. Apparently everything wants to catch on fire today in this world. So let's get rid of some of this lava. Alright. Nothing. So we've already been to this one too. Oh, that figures. Because this is the area that we wanted to come to. For the bamboo, I believe. I'd like to get different types of tree seeds, um, and I'd like to find us a village. Uh, it's just a little glitchy while that loads in here. Let's go up on the top of here until we're finally getting into areas that I have not been into. From the way that it is loading. Really glitchy. Come on now. Another lava pit. Seems as though we have a lot of these around this one. In this world, we have a lot of lava pits. I don't know why. I don't know what the deal is with the lava pits, but uh Die Punk. Sorry, I don't know why I killed him. Look, another lava pit. This is crazy. Why are there so many lava pits around here? I kind of want to just start covering them with water just to not have them sitting out, but at the same time, holy cow. What's on fire up here? Is this another lava pit? Wow. There's so many lava pits up here. Why? Why are there so many lava pits around here? This is nuts, man. I don't think I've ever seen this many lava pits in an area before. Alright, so we're still going along here. Looks like we got another one of the Acacia Woods area. We're not going backwards, are we? No, we're over a thousand blocks away from home now. So as we go through here, we are not seeing anything special so far. So I will come back once I find something good. Alright guys, I'm back. And as you can see through the trees here, it looks like we may have finally found our first village. Now, in this game it looks like we are about 1500 blocks away and about a 
good uh, 400, 1500 blocks one way and 400 blocks the other way away from home. So let's hope this is not an abandoned one and it does have some stuff. That's a nice color bed actually. Looks like this is spawned a little bit weirdly. Oh, nice little small villager. What's up, buddy? Right, we got some hay bales here that I won't mind if I do. It's not like they're using them, guys. All right, let's see what's in here. Wow, that is a small house. Alright, what do we got over here? Ooh, a chest. Ooh, some bread. Oh, no. Yeah, we might as well take these, too. I'm not worried about the seeds. Alrighty here. Didn't look like there was a whole lot of villagers here so far. Nope, they're all over here. More. That is awesome. I shall take that. Oh, a nice little golem buddy. Oh, nice, nice. A saddle. We'll definitely take the leather. Lead there. I can't talk today, guys. So, let's see, what do you want to trade? Potatoes, emeralds. He's, he wants leather. He doesn't have a job. He doesn't have a job. Okay, so it looks like we found our first village with a bunch of different villagers in there. That uh, seems like a pretty good thing. So far, so good, guys. Nice red bed. Uh, red bed. Alright, let's see. Take all the hay bales I can. Uh, it looks like that's all of the village, guys. So on the next episode, I will be trying to take back some of these villagers back home to our location. Or we can just come back here in the future and just kind of build this up to be our next little village area so we don't have to worry about getting them all the way back around. So I would like to take... Oh, wow, this is weird looking. So, I guess what we could do actually is build our nice little area here to breed and trade with villagers uh, and get different things going Let's see, what do you trade? You have nothing. No, you got nothing. That sucks. So, this is where we are at so far. I don't really have anything good here. Uh, we are a good 2,000 blocks away from home. Our base is around 500 and 100, and you can see we are about 2,000 blocks. So we actually have to go in that direction. So what I'll do is I'll head in that direction. Go right down the coordinates of this village. And now we can come back to this village after we find a nice little way to get there. So let's take this path back towards the house and see what we see, guys. Maybe we can find a closer village. You never know. Look how tall these mountains are now in this game. This is crazy. You can find lots of coal and iron up there. That is a definite. No matter what you're looking for, if you find tall mountains, you will find iron and coal. I would love it if we could find a nice lush cave. That would be awesome. Let's see what is going on over here. I did not pick that up, did I? Oh, we don't want seeds. Oh, we got plenty of that at home. That's a big old mountain. Okay, so... Still, no, we're going up. Oh, we gotta go this way. Why was I going the wrong way, guys? 
don't know. I don't know about you guys, but I always get turned around. It does not matter what I do. I always lose the route that I'm going. I think one mod I wish I had installed playing this version is like waypoints where you can set stuff down and you can see it kind of on the in the level to where you can actually travel the but hey, we'll kick it old school. So I believe we go through this forest here, bunch of trees. be that hard to get the villagers back to our house if that's what we truly just I have none sorry guys I would tame us a wolf here but uh, kind of need bones for that so if we remember we'll bring that back with us let's see we're still 2,000 blocks around 1,500 blocks away that looks like our biome over here, where our house is located. I think we're on the other side of it. Ooh, we're going fishing. We're swimming with the fishes. I do watch a lot of different YouTubers and they always have stuff to say and it's always interesting. So it looks like, whoa. I'm glad I seen that in the last second there. Looks like we're going in this direction, guys. So I'll be back once we get back home. Alright, guys, I'm back and I discovered a few different things that uh, I hadn't gotten yet. And I believe I've gotten some of the jungle wood, but I figured I'd do a nice little time lapse for you guys uh, on taking down some of these trees and then going back home. So, hope you enjoy.
right guys, as you see we have made it back home and it is decided to rain. So thanks for watching this video and if you have any suggestions or anything else, just please don't hesitate to like, comment, subscribe and follow for more content like this. Uh, in our next coming videos I would like to create maybe a auto farm of some sort, uh, maybe a chicken coop, uh, stuff like that for some eggs. Uh, we'll put our bed back, set a respawn, and thanks for watching guys. Have a good one.